Hello everyone, I'm Mark Snodgrass, and today I wanted to show you how to use the trellis feature in Domo for bar cards to kind of help show the top end of a uh, particular um, visualization that might be doing to help show the main drivers of what's uh, going on might be causing something to help things be more actionable for your viewer and uh, clear away some of the clutter. So here we have just kind of the standard bar chart showing the average cost of an injury uh, by body part. And we wanna kind of make this a little bit more useful. So one way to do that would be to use the trellis feature and the chart properties. If we go to show as, we have uh, trellis categories and tr tiered dates. In this instance, we're gonna use trellis categories. And when we do that, it's gonna open up uh, another field to be able to use called category two. And we can just drag in some states into here, do that. Now we're gonna see different states show up across the top. Um, it's getting kind of busy down here. Uh, we see a lot of uh, different body parts in for each state. And we can even take this further. If we uh, kind of show what kind of type of injury these were. Uh, then we've got uh, fatalities, indemnity, medical only, and then that's now broken up by uh, the states within there. And then within that, then showing the, the body part and then highest cost of injuries. And it's showing the highest cost of injuries because of this sorting property of average total reported we're doing. So it's showing those from high to low, but this chart is pretty unreadable at this point. So how do we kind of show the, the highest two highest ones, let's say, uh, in this instance. So help uh, somebody looking at this be a little bit more responsive on what's going on. So under the trellis tier date properties, you can go to maximum bars and choose two, for instance, you do that. That's gonna clean that up, makes the category threes uh, more readable and the category twos. And then now we're showing for each of those types and subtypes, what are the highest, the two highest uh, body part average cost of injuries. So we're seeing those listed along the left here, uh, along the bottom rather, sorry. And again, that's driven by uh, the sorting properties, be able to do that. So that makes that much more readable uh, and actionable for whoever might be looking at this card. So you can see this then in the full view uh, a lot better, a lot easier to, to look at. So again, that's making use of the trellis feature. We go back into the chart properties. You're gonna find that down here and showing that's trellis categories, let you drag in category two, or category three, and then setting the maximum bars to however many you want. And then it'll sort those automatically for you, which is really, really handy. Hope you found this useful. Um, again, I'm Mark Snodgrass and feel free to reach out to me with any questions. Have a great day.